What's up, everybody? It's your favorite show, favorite show, Get a Bucket. I'm your host, Trey, and as usual, I hope you're all having a wonderful, wonderful day. And as you can see, we got my guy, Byron, here. Byron, how's everything with you, man? It's going good, man. It's going good. We had basketball this morning. A little banged up. <laughs> a little banged up. <laughs> banged up. Hey, listen, like, it, he, he played well, though, ladies and gentlemen. He played well. He hustled. Um, he was moving them puppies on the defensive end too. I can't lie to you. Like it was a good, it was a good team effort. It was a good team effort. We played about three games, you know, two and one. Uh, we got Ryan and them boys out there. You know, Ryan and Derek lost. They took, they took an L. You know, it's okay though. Nah, they played good too. We got to, I want, I, I, we got to get all new together and just really have a, a solid little five on five game session. Um, I got to hand out a couple more L's. You know, we got to, got to dish out a couple more L's. But um, right. cause we're gonna transition on. To the NFC West. Now, with this division, ladies and gentlemen, we got here a nice one. Uh, we got the Seahawks, we got the Cardinals, you know what I mean? 49ers and the Rams. Now, we were just talking about the Rams a little bit. Uh, 49ers, y'all all know about, especially last season, because for those of y'all who love to have memes going around, they did beat the Cowboys. Shout out to them. Uh, you got the Cardinals, who, you know, they gave us some wonderful news over the summertime about how Kyler Murray, or at least all season, how Kyler Murray wasn't studying playbook and whatnot, playing video games, stuff like that. You got the Seahawks. Geno Smith and them, they did well last season. Um, there's a lot of storylines this, this, this in this division. Who's your winner, though? Because I got to say, it for me, I think it boils down to the 49ers. But, I mean, there's a couple sleepers in this in this division. Like, I think this is, a, this is a strong division personally. But what's your thoughts, Byron? Yeah, I mean, I think 49ers is the clear cut. Um, but also, too, though, right, they're banking on Purdy to be this guy. You know, they, you know they're banking on – I was checking out his numbers. I think out of nine games, he threw for like 1,200 yards, 13 touchdowns, four picks. So, something like that. So, that's – you know, that's – that's you know that's good, right? That's good. That's solid numbers, right? You know he's in a he you know he has Kyle Shanahan who is an offensive guru, as they say. Mm -hmm. So granted, you know he just needs somebody to kind of just you know pick and dump guys, you know pick and dump, boom, height, throw the ball to the open man based on the scheme. He believes his scheme is better than the personnel which he has, right? So if that seems to be true, yeah, give me the Forty ers but. I mean, I think they got Nick Bosa, so they got a, they got one of the best defensive ends in you know, the stop in, uh, Yeah, I mean, in NFL, right? They got a stout, stout defense. Their offense doesn't have to be super efficient because their defense is so good. But they have a good offense too. They do have a good offense too. They got a lot. They got a lot of good weapons. They got a lot. They got they got McCaffrey and Debo. Who McCaffrey catches like a slot. He, I mean, I, you know, I see him receiver, being, yeah, yeah, right. yeah. He's a wide receiver. So you know they, and then they have Debo, who's a running back and wide receiver, right? So they got so many different combinations. And they got Brandon. Hard. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, they got it's it's hard for them not to for me to say the forty nine. It's it's very difficult. They got so many weapons to choose from, you know. So I would say the forty ers Yeah, I, I just want to I just want to come to a conclusion real quick. Um. Byron, you said that the NFC was trash. Just to clarify, like you, you said, as a whole, as a unit, as an organization, the NFC was trash. Is that right? Like, is that is that is that was that right earlier? Absolutely. Um, absolutely. I did it. Aggressive. Absolutely. If I would, if I were to have the top ten teams in the NFL right now, and I did this last week, only two of them are NFC teams. What two teams that I see is that Forty ers and who? Eagles. And the Eagles. Yep. There's only there's only two teams that I would even consider, and I think because I was looking at NFL Network or ESPN's rankings, the power mm -hmm. rankings. I don't know why the Cowboys are fifth or sixth. That is the that is crazy talk. Well, I mean, crazy talent talk. wise, they talent wise, they 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 up there now. I, I don't I don't think we can be too disrespectful about that. Yeah, but, but yeah, but ever, talent wise, but if you if you look at and this is no order. Give me Kansas City, give me Philly, give me San Francisco, give me Cincinnati, you give me uh you give me Baltimore, you give me the, the Chargers, you give me the uh I, I, the, um, I see yeah, I mean you give me it's just it's just too many and I can keep going with the AFC with the AFC. Like you give me all these teams. If you look at the AFC East that we talked about the other day, they got three teams who can win that division. Like who who could arguably go to the AFC championship. 
give me the AFC, give me the AFC uh, North, right? AFC, I mean, um, AFC East. You got even even the Patriots, who are supposed to be the worst team. All right, I'm gonna stop you. I'm, I'm gonna stop you right there, Byron. Now you're talking about now. You, now we're being disrespectful, respectfully. Like I can't put the Patriots over too many teams like that. I would not. Take no, no, I'm not. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying they're the bottom tier of that division. They're the bottom tier of that division, and I still don't think that they'll be that bad. It's exactly. stout. That's the, yeah, but that's my that's, point. That's stout. You got Miami, you got the Jets, and you got and you got Buffalo. You see what I'm saying? But those are three teams. So I can name three teams from the AFC East, three teams from the AFC North, three teams from the AFC West. I I, I can name the Broncos, who I think will be good, the Chargers, and Kansas City. That's nine teams, who I believe. Yeah, but that ain't than, this ain't typical though. Normally, it's like you get yeah, and, Eagles. <laughs> you got Packers in there. Vikings and made a push. Yeah. Although you might say bottom of the pack. Um, one of the teams from the South might make a noise. I might make some noise, but typically it's been like the Saints. Um, and then like the Seahawks, 49ers, Rams, they just been having like a, a, a little lull, if you will. Um, well, not, not 49ers, but like they're normally in the top tier running as well. So I, it's, you know, it's just a down little, a down little stint. But to say the NFC as a whole is trash, I think they, we might have some teams that surprise you, Byron. I think we might. But um, we're going to have to see because, again, I just, I just wanted to make sure I had that on record to always be certain. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, another, time, another time. But, uh, no, I appreciate it, Byron. Thank you for definitely coming on to the show, my boy. Do you have anything you want to say before we close up shop? No, nah, man, I hope you all have a great Labor Day weekend. Enjoy your day off and things like that. Y'all be blessed. Definitely, definitely, definitely. That's a dope shirt you got, by the way, my boy. It's a dope shirt you got there, by the way. But I appreciate it. <laughs> all right, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you all enjoyed that. We just covered the NFC. Uh, we also got some uh, wide receiver debate as well, AFC discussion, a whole bunch of NFL. Because, again, we all it's called Get a Bucket, but we talk about football and other sports as well. So I hope you all enjoyed it. So please like, subscribe, comment, tell anyone, anyone about the show. Hope you all have a good one. Take care. <laughs> Not know you guys were still here. As, as, as you can see, we're at the back end of the show. No pun intended, but look, hope you all enjoyed it. And before you go, please subscribe to the YouTube channel, follow the IG account, share the content to anybody who's anybody. And most importantly, leave your thoughts and comments below. But I gotta go back and play Buddy in 2K, so let me unmute him real quick. Excuse me. Hey, boss, I'm back. Nah, you better catch this word. You know, we get buckets around here,